own name right now. Miss Princess Casserole here. And I am here. Um, I want to do some more work on the heart that we were working on before. As well as I need everybody's opinion on something. I'm going to take these take these um, tags off. Hello, Dwayne. It has been a long time since we have talked. Dwayne and I. Um, I know we've kind of talked about this before on my channel, but I do very much enjoy doing YouTube. I found some, some really great friends on here. So I got all these different colors of felt. So I'll show you guys what I normally do. And I need your opinion on what color to do. And I'll show you guys. So I'm constantly picking up frame, picture frames um, to do crafts with. And also I pick up some of the bigger ones because... Every year, we usually get our pictures done, family pictures, and I always get three pictures to put on the wall. I usually do one of my daughter herself, one of the three of us, and one of Jim and myself. These are, some of these are really thin don't love that because you will see some of the stuff on the bottom. Um, but. So I will show you guys the one that I have done most recently. <laughs> so this is one of the ones I've finished. And this was, was difficult. Hopefully, um, so... There is a little bit of, of gold that comes on. I know it's the salmon one is very thin, isn't it? Um, this one is thin too, but it doesn't matter because the what I'll show you what I do underneath. It's a cardboard and so you like it doesn't doesn't matter. Um, but so there is some that you can see underneath. I probably should have put a layer on here first and then put the stuff on it so what I did was really nice with this one because normally I get to use all of my rhinestone jewelry and things like that in these but this time I got to use all of my worn textury pieces yeah so this is more of a steampunky bison and um, I had all these little gears that I got from a flea market that I added on here and I'll show you guys this paint because I think I'm going to do something else but not exactly with this color paints there's some other ones that give it like a patina look um so I, I will probably do something else with that in the future as well um but I love the way this one turned out you do have to be careful because um since it's like paint on metal it doesn't like it, it's, it is kind of fragile, so you don't want to like drop it or anything, but because everything's glued on there, you probably wouldn't want to do it anyway. But I found this beautiful frame and I, like I said, so I always get these from the thrift stores. They're like a couple dollars each. And so it looks really nice here. And I don't know where this one's going to go. It's one of my favorite ones that I've done just because it's a little bit different. So I love this one and I wanted to show you guys. And so I finally found a picture frame for one of my other ones. So what I normally do is I will take out the glass, will throw the glass in the recycling because I won't ever use it again for these frames. And I, I like the color on here. I needed something that was like a pinky color and this does these always get so much stuff under them but what I normally do is there's usually 
cardboard in here. And so I will glue the felt to the cardboard and then glue my buffalo or heart or whatever on top of it. So I am going to say, I know I do like the salmon color, but I just think it's, it's not going to be good underneath that. So I agree with Dwayne. Unfortunately, that one's got to go. This one, let's see. See, the, that's the funny thing. Even though this one's thin too, like you can't really see that much. So, so let's just see. This is normally what I'll do. I'll just, you know, put something on there. See what it looks like. And then put, put the buffalo on it. This is going on the felt. So I do like this color combo a lot. Hola, como esta? Um, so I do like this. Let's see if I like any of the other ones. I don't think I like this blue. It is too, too much. This blue is too dark. There's no reds. This is the only other option I would probably do. This one's too bright. It's hard because there's only so many different options that you have, you know? So, so far this is my winner. But let me see it with the gray just to, to see it. And I do like it because it's, yeah, it's like the bright, the neutral, and then the bright pink. I think the other one, right? We're going with the other one, the light one. You just never know. I always put it behind me. So what I, what I do, I will use one of these two. Should I use this one or the other one? I don't think it really matters. We use, we use this one. Yeah, we use this one. This is nice and flat. This is not nice and flat, but it's not going to matter. See, I do sometimes use the big one. I like the other one, but okay. Where did I put my scissors? So what I do is I will use this as a guide to cut out the felt. Doesn't have to be exact. And the felt is really cheap for the most part. So it's, it's nice. So for the most part, you know, these, you need some tools like scissors and things that you guys probably already have. I get picture frames from yard sales. It's another good place. Rummage sales, um, the thrift store. I always pick them up when I find nice, nice picture frames because they're useful. And the E6000. You do need wire cutters. That's what these are called when you make the, um, the things. And that's, you know, it's not... Not that terribly difficult. Oh yeah, this is the white one I got by accident. I did not mean to get the white one. There's a white and a black and a clear. Let's see, it says white on there. It'll work anyway, because it's light, but I just, you don't want to use this for your hearts. I did use it for the steampunk one because it didn't matter. Um, because I painted it with that, that paint after anyway. Eek. Folded. See, and even though you can see through it, it's really not, not that 
big of a deal. I kind of like it because it makes it a little bit more, um, I don't know, raw maybe? Is that a weird word? So I put that on there. I can also use the white fur for the buffalo because you're not going to see it. So I normally take that and I will put it in here first because it's hard to know where to position things and once you've done it, you've done it, you know? So I put it in there. So nice like that. And then I will put on my buffalo or heart or whatever I'm going to do. Because then it'll be easier to place and you just want to place it in there once. I should probably measure. You know, normal people probably measure. You can double layer felt. Um, I don't mind with this one. One day I probably will want to use that salmon color. And that's probably what I will do. I will glue it and then just put more glue on top of it and double do that one. Just because I love that color, it's just, it wouldn't have been right. So, I just kind of get a sense and then I will take my E6000 and I will glue it. And because I'm laying it flat to dry like this, it's not really going to matter that the felt is still wet also. Believe it or not, boy, this stuff sticks. So I never have a problem with the E6000. And I'm not using my little... Um, some things today because when I'm doing it on big pieces like this, I'm not really going to get it on my fingers in the same way. Um, this, no, so I have one I have to make for a friend. And I often, the, the heart is for my aunt. Okay, so what I'll usually do here is my pinkies to get it where I want it. without touching it. And you don't want to move it because then you'll get glue and you'll see the glue and, you know, you don't want to do that. So that is... This one, which I really wanted to do one with all these flowers. And I thought it, like, it turned out so girly. So, <laughs> what a contrast, huh, between this really girly one and this one that could end up in, like, a library somewhere with, like, leather-bound books. And this one could just go in a nursery. <laughs> so... That's, you know, the range of some of these things. And then this one, I think, will hopefully be, be a little bougie. So, yeah, that's what they look like. I really love it, how they turned out. And, like I said, I will lay it flat to dry. And then it'll be fine. I gotta put it somewhere where my cat won't sit on it, though. where it won't fall all right I did pull some extra things I do really I really like both of those those turned out nice and like I was talking to you guys about before with the perfectionism it can be really difficult for me sometimes um this one can be nice too because I'm just so, so hard on myself. I 
I had another another thing here, but I think it's just for other types of crafting here. Because I did pull, pull some other things. Oopsie. Wait. Pull some other things to try to get something that looks good. Because we don't have that much left to finish, so we gotta, oh yeah, that's right, I pulled this, and that'll go nice there. I do have a couple different shapes, and I just, I like to make things kind of different, you know, I don't like doing the same things. So this is kind of then the hard part of what I like to do. I like this one. I think this one's going to go on here somewhere. You know, I don't even know, Dwayne. I just kind of do what looks good to my eye. Which is probably <clears throat> probably random more so than anything. Doesn't um your wife like to craft too? I got this one to for when I start doing my necklaces again. <laughs> I thought it was pretty funny. Ah. That's nice there. All right. He's going to go there. I do I do find it nice and relaxing. Even with all the perfectionism that goes into it for me. All right. Let me actually, I'm going to get my, my fingers on. Hmm. Like dark underneath? No, I have not. But I have another, I have another heart that I haven't painted yet. So I can do, I can do that. <laughs> These are so that I don't get the E6000 all over my fingers because it's not good for you. It is cancer causing, so I try, try not to. We do talk about safety on our channel. Try not to poke your eye out when you're cutting these things. Nope, don't like that. <laughs> or at least second, yes. I think that that can go somewhere like that. I'm gonna need a rhinestone. That's the thing. Most people don't care, like if you don't have the rhinestones, but I'm a crazy person and it'll bother me. Okay, that's going there. Cause that's all I'll see. They are. That's why I say make sure you are in a well ventilated large room. 
Don't do it in a small space. We don't want to breathe it or touch it. Because we all want to live a long time and bother our kids forever, right? That's my goal anyway. She got to bother me for a long time. I get to bother her for a long time. I like that. That's going there. And my husband, too. He's younger than me, so... Geeks. And this one is definitely for my aunt. So this one is going to her. I also have a necklace that I'm going to put with it. She loves hearts. Don't we know a couple of people who love hearts in our community? <laughs> Yeah. What what point is having children if you can't annoy them forever? I mean, really. And embarrass them because those are the fun parts of life. I didn't raise them for nothing for all those years, right? <laughs> so yeah, I I do I do try to be safe. I don't use this stuff a lot either, so Well, thank you, Dwayne. I appreciate that very much. Yeah, so I just I keep going until it looks nice. <laughs> I have no rhyme or reason really of what I do. That may or may not bother some people. I don't know. But like Popeye says, I am what I am, and that's all that I am. And that is probably annoying. That's what I am. Life's more fun that way anyway. Nope. It's funny, I, I thought I did find a whole bunch of stuff yesterday that I threw in here. Oh, look at that. I just, I like building it up a little bit. Because you can always cover things pretty easily. I am not an expert. Sometimes people say this or that, and it's like, I just try my best. That's all I do. I'm not at crafting, anyways. There we go. And we don't go for perfection here. We just go for good enough. There we go. I like that. That looks good. I 
It's funny, E6000 has a, a rhinestone comet. That sounds amazing. Um, E6000 has, like, strings, too, which is kind of funny. I feel like this will be too gold. Oh, that looks nice there. We're going with that there. I just piece things together until they fit. And sometimes I feel like I would grade myself in A+. Plus. And other times I grade myself a B. Or an F. Funny thing is, my Fs, like, usually people like it anyway, you know? So it's like, we're always so much harder on ourselves than anyone else ever, ever would be. Oh, but that's nice. Let's try. Thank you, Katie. I appreciate that. Um, yeah, probably my, like, call her my sister-in-law. She's not my sister-in-law yet. Hopefully one day she will be. But I think I might, she might get one. I'm going to put that there. <laughs> my daughter is actually one of the most amazing human beings I've ever met. She's incredibly hardworking. Just bought her first vehicle. Oops, I meant to put this, I think. This way? Does it this way? It fits so perfectly before. Eek. Don't don't give up. How does that happen? It goes over a little bit, but it's fine, I think. <laughs> they talk about not worrying about perfection that's fine you're that's that's what's happening for you you're just you're just living your best life here and we'll just have to find something to uh bring those things together here which that will but i need a darn rhinestone for you or something to call it call cover that one hola See, this one also. So this one is fun, also. Weak. <laughs> I do like this one. Where'd that? Oh, the sticky thing came out of here. Nice. So now he's just a ball. Pull the flower from the bottom. This, this one? You can't see that one, so obviously not. Oh, that one looks nice. This was a little green. Mm-mm-mm. Mm -hmm. Now, sad one said, this is a single earring. This one I got here, too. Oops. 
Nope, that one, those weren't singles. I gotta clean him up. He's gonna be something weird. Cat is not happy downstairs today. We put her in the basement because otherwise she won't sleep with us. Um, really. She'll like get into everything while we're trying to sleep. And if we don't let her in the bedroom, she just cries at the door forever. So, in order to get any sleep, we give her treats. And she normally nicely and patiently waits downstairs for us until the morning time. Apparently, today she does not want to do that. I like that there. Yes, we're gonna put that there. I think I have more somewhere. It can be difficult to find the, uh, find rhinestone, um, craft stuff. Thank you, Miss Jar Jar. You've been leaving the most beautiful comments. Very much appreciated. This one needs a rhinestone. That's why I'm, that's going to go there, I think. I mean, I can put the rhinestone on later. Let's just put it there. Because I can always find one and add it later. And I will find one. There we go. We will find you a friend to complete you. This one was so pretty, but it, it broke. I don't know how to take that one apart. I also had these guys that had fallen. I'm not going to put that on here, but like, it's so cute. And I have two of them, but they're little celluloids. You know, this, this could be nice up a little bit give it some dimension because it will look a little bit different there. Oh, I like that there. I'm just going to throw that there. I did go to Whole Foods today also and got a really bougie candle. Yeah, I like that. It's building up. It smells divine. Look at how pretty that is, but it's so big. It's too big. Um, it smells of maple. I got it last year. It's 
like a $20 candle from Whole Foods, which what would you expect from Whole Foods, but it smells divine. Oh, that looks nice. Huh. And we can still put some little stuff up there. Don't hate that. I kind of like the crazy angles of this. All right, I'm going with it. We're trusting our instincts here, guys. Um, what keeps me motivated on my creativity is having too much stuff in the house and feeling like I need to actually do something with it. <laughs> oh, is that any better? I know it's, it's not focusing probably because I just have too much stuff here. That could be a little helpful. Is that better? Hopefully. Nope. All right, let's see. What's next? So yeah, I, I end up spending so much money on like craft supplies and things. And then, you know, if I don't do it, then it's just like wasted. And also like, I just end up getting overwhelmed. Which I was going to do a video about that sometime soon. Just the overwhelming amount of stuff that I have. It just, it is actually quite overwhelming. And, you know, every once in a while I just want to have a little breakdown. Because, because I don't know what to do with it. Well, I have a lot of stuff in my craft room as well. Can't really say too, too much. Nope, it's too big. I think we all have kind of good intentions sometimes, you know? And again, if she's got that perfectionism at all, also, you know, it just, it can be a lot sometimes. That can get overwhelming. Um, it's oddly overwhelming sometimes to have nice craft supplies, which sounds weird, right? Ooh, this is going somewhere. But you feel like if you use them, you won't be able to use them in other ways and maybe there could have been a better thing for you to do with it it's just this really odd 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 thing that happens 
All right, he's going to go somewhere. I just don't know where yet. At least I think it will. I do end up, I did end up really liking these. Not there though, not yet. That is not where it's meant to be. Yeah, it's, it's a very strange thing sometimes. And anxiety is, is a very strange thing also. Like, like you? You're going to go there, whether you like it or not. That's where you belong right now. I always wash my hands after I craft and do anything with jewelry also, by the way. And... Thankfully, today, which, you know, you should have this too, safety first, got my tetanus shot. <laughs> I think we're going to try to put one of these ones in that hole. Look at this one. This one kind of looks like a Tetris game. Tetris, you going somewhere. <laughs> that is that not a word? Is that not a word? Ah Tetris, you don't wanna cooperate, do ya? Do ya do ya do ya? Yeah, and this will help my anxiety a little bit, too, because getting early starts on Christmas gifts. And believe it or not, so I, I do need to do one for my brother-in-law, too. He loves this stuff, actually, way more than my sister would. And I want to find some crosses and stuff to put in there. That piece near the bottom. This guy? Yeah, you think I should? Something else can go there. There's like a little string on here I'm trying to get off as well. Something will go there. It'll be fine. That's the thing. I try not to worry about making mistakes. Because they're almost always quite fixable. Unlike in life. Oh, that looks nice, but that, that can fit. It's not perfect. Something else will need to go there, but again, I like layering up. So my aunt also loves crafts. She's been making all kinds of crafts. So I do think she will really like this. And 
like I said, she loves hearts. I made her bouquet for her wedding. Her, I think it was just hers. Hers and his, maybe. That is not something I will willingly do again for anyone who is not incredibly close to me. Because, my goodness, that was, that was a lot. That was probably the most I've done. See, this one's pretty, too. That was, the making of the bouquets was, was so, so much. You know, I really never really thought about adding these guys, but I could do that too. Hmm. What else we got, people? I thought this would be really cute on something. Not on this, but on something. We are so close. looking to see if I can find any any other odds and ends. Oh, I have this guy. Oh, he likes things. Yes, this one is for my aunt for Christmas. And I'm going to give her a heart necklace as well. I was like, where did that go? Oh yeah, her bouquet, I think was red. I've made all kinds of different ones. I've made, all right, I like that there. That's fine. Well, we keep building guys. We keep building, keep finding new stuff. We'll need something here now. We'll need something there. But it's getting there. I do quite like this. I just don't know where it belongs. It almost belongs there, but not quite. I don't like it there. Might live to see another another day. Probably. Oh, I bet. Like the they took me so so long to do. They're beautiful. Um, and one of the ones, so I, I've made them for myself. Um, a friend that I've known since middle school and my aunt. So I've done them three times now. And I'm glad I did because 
my friend passed away and young. I mean, she was, she was very young. It was very sad. And, you know, it's nice because I was able to do something nice for her before she was gone. That was something that I, you know, good at and meant something. Yeah. But that's why I like that there. I think. Oh, no, I like it there better. But that's why I think crafting can be so rewarding, is that he makes something special for somebody, you know? And it's something you'll remember forever. <laughs> okay, where'd that go? Oh, here it is. Come on, guy. Like it or not, you're going in there. You stay. <laughs> not nice. I worry about gluing these because sometimes the foils can wear away. Mm. So I try not to normally do that much. I do love this guy, but I just, I don't know. Oh, that's, that is cute. Mm, I like that. I like that there. Alright, I'm going to put that there. I'm going to put a little something there. Just a little something. I think I'm just going to put those there because that'll help. Or that could help too. I don't know. I just want to cover up. This little area that I did. Aha. Like, it's not hard to get off now, but once this is on here for, it's, it's on here forever. So I'm trying to get it off now. Okay. I 
And I like these little finger things because the gloves sometimes can really like make it so it's hard to move. There we go. And I'm put I'm gonna put that. Yep, still fits nicely. I'm gonna put that there, but I need something here first. And I don't know if this will fit. Oh yeah. Yeah, that fits. I'm gonna put that underneath. I'm so close, guys. And I let this dry before I will put it in a frame. That frame I just put that last buffalo in would also oops, be perfect. I like it. However, something already has a home in there. I, there was a, a lady who sold ones kind of like this at an antique store and the frames were so cheap. I just didn't understand why she didn't like, get frames from Goodwill or something. All right. Look at how close we are, guys. So close. just need stuff here and maybe some stuff here in tiny little places. I wonder if this would work. Nope. <laughs> it is not one to work. I think it might, but it's fine. I have another one of those somewhere. It's kind of cute, too. Little... Those can be nice to do when you do things like that. <laughs> Where is the other one? I have no idea what my cat is doing, but something crazy, something, something tells me it's just nothing good. <laughs> I think these are all the same size. So this is a beautiful necklace, but it was already broken. All right. We are, where did I put my flyers? Sometimes I do this too. I want to put that right there. It's another way to not get glue on your hands. No, we 
is so perfect. And then, see? There we go. That was exactly where I wanted it. That is, though, the problem of perfection. I like it to be covered, completely, completely covered. <laughs> like the most blingy heart ever. Yeah, heart, you go in there. Sometimes I don't mind if it's not perfect. And sometimes, like, I kind of think it makes it more perfect. Just, and it's an imperfection, you know? And I kind of sometimes like it not to make sense. <laughs> now you sound like my boss. Couldn't tell if that was glue or rhinestone. I am a huge perfectionist at work. It is a problem. Oh, thank you. Really close. I just need stuff here, I think. I try to cover like everything, but sometimes think like the areas are just me. Well, I'm part native, so you know maybe maybe that's why <laughs> we do this. I also do a weird thing where I don't finish things. It's a very bad habit of mine where I'll like, I'll do the dishes, but I won't do all of the dishes. I'll do like most of the dishes. Almost there. <sighs> That's so hard because there's something here. There's something needed there. gonna bother me something perfect needs to go there that I cannot see right now hmm. I'm just looking through some different items I have. Some things that are super sad because like this is the most beautiful earring but I only have one of them.
Yep. Definitely something needs to go here. I just don't know what yet. I love that. I have some of the most beautiful things, but I've been able to capture. So close. This so gorgeous. I have, I have some very nice things. I just Much nicer. Okay. Well, that's going there. Closer to done, guys. So I just need something there. Close, close, but no cigar. This could do it. Let's see. Argentina, how wonderful. Although, want to break then? I don't know. We're going to take the chance here. Ah, they're so slinky. You know what? We're going to put this on first, and then we'll put that on over it. I think, think this will do it. That's hope. That'll still work there.
Yep. I like it. I like it. All right. I think, I think we're done. He's like digging through my, my little bag. Oops, ow. Here, let's see. I'll show you guys with a nicer, plain background. So that is what it looks like. I like it. So I'll show you. I can take my, my fingers off now. Look how dirty they get. Isn't that gross? <laughs> That's why, like, after I wore those the other day, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna... Those are the two fingers I use the most, so... So this is it close up. And it did end up being a nice level. As you guys can kind of see, it is raised. I did not think I was going to be able to use the bow, but I really do like that. And like, if I really wanted to, I can do more stuff, but I feel like it looks nice. And then next time, once this dries, We'll figure out a nice picture frame and background for it. So thank you guys so much for joining me. It's so much more fun to craft with you, with you guys and kind of have some opinions. Top left, this over here, like just here. Well, if we need to tomorrow, sometimes what I do is I'll take a look. You think so? Or are you being... being she's silly <laughs> um but yeah i will sometimes i'll take a look at it tomorrow make sure i like the way everything looks but yeah it's so much more fun crafting with you guys and getting opinions on colors and placements on you know if something looks good or not so i very much appreciate it and please like comment share subscribe i know people were asking for more craft videos so I really have been enjoying doing this again recently so thank you guys for joining me bye guys